This is Paul Turner, the Immigration Barrister at Imperium Chambers. Thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you have an immigration problem, please get in touch with me and I'll do my best to help you. Today I'm following on from the good news of yesterday's video, which is yet another new immigration route that's been announced. Uh, and this is called the High Potential Visa. Following on my, from my video uh, yesterday on the Scale-Up Visa, this video will concentrate on the proposed High Potential Visa. Details of which are likely to be released in spring 2022 as a result of the report of, the, of July 2021 from the Department of Business, Energy and Industrial Strategy, who published a policy paper entitled UK Innovation Strategy Leading the Future by Creating It. This paper sets out the UK strategy for seeking to recruit the brightest and best to the United Kingdom post-Brexit, whilst it also ignores the number of people that could qualify who are already in the country, um, but we're not looking at that today. So who is the high potential visa aimed at? Well, the government says that the, the proposed high potential visa is aimed at highly skilled and academically elite migrants looking to share their talent and make contributions to the United Kingdom economy. Uh, this will include global innovators and entrepreneurs wanting to work or set up business in the United Kingdom. And as you'll recall, um, some 49% of the, the top performing companies um, have one non-UK born resident um, involved in them. The route is, is also designed at making it easier for established UK companies and organisations to recruit the talent they need to make them world leading. Um, now this is a, a big step forward because at present things are quite strict under the tier two system. Uh, the, the various areas that are considered are technology, digital technology, uh, vaccine breakthroughs, obviously highly important, or in various other uh, industries and sectors. So it's quite wide. As anyone uh, with any immigration experience or law will know, at present, the points-based system uh, is restrictive and cumbersome to say the least. There are hundreds and hundreds of pages and, and various documents that all need to be supplied. The next obviously qu question following on from that is what are the likely eligibility requirements needed to obtain a high potential visa? Well, without proper guidance and proper rules in place, we can but speculate that under the new high potential visa, eligibility will be open to applicants who have graduated from a top global university. The UK government will also be exploring the scope to expand eligibility under this route to other characteristics of high potential, so other people that have got a lot to offer the UK. Further, um, uh, uh, and, and this counters some of what's said uh, about migrants generally, to ensure that the UK benefits from a surge of high skilled migration, there will be no job offer requirement, which is again a welcome departure from the rules regarding tier two migrants, which are quite strict. This new route will give visa holders the flexibility to work or switch jobs or switch employers, something again that is not open under the current system. As an unsponsored work route, this will make it much, much easier for overseas talent who demonstrate high potential to come to the United Kingdom even without a job offer. Uh, the lack of a job offer or sponsor makes this, in my view, a highly promising uh, route that will enable many people who have a lot to offer the United Kingdom the chance to come and live in the United Kingdom and contribute to the United Kingdom economy and ultimately settle in the United Kingdom. As I've noted that the specific details have not been published yet, however, as soon as they are and as soon as the rules are published, I will um, put out a, a more detailed video describing exactly what is required to qualify for the high potential visa. However, this is a, it's a pleasant change to be talking about positive and new immigration routes rather than uh, merely commenting on the broken immigration system. So this is the uh, second uh, in a series of, uh, of new immigration routes that should be coming into force in spring 2022. Another one is going to follow tomorrow. So please tune in and see what the next route is. Thank you very much for watching. Please stay safe during the pandemic. These are dangerous times. I've had COVID myself. Um, and again, if you have any problems or you have any doubts about your immigration status, do get in touch with me. Thank you again for watching. This is Paul Turner, the Immigration Barrister at Imperium Chambers.